Okay, guys, this, um, I left these like this because I needed to finish that reading from last night. And y'all have to, y'all have to, ick, ick. Excuse me if, um, you know, sometimes I'm talking a little more uh, slur-tongued and slow or whatever because it's around the time of my monthly. And for some odd reason, I get a draggy voice or whatever. And um, my words, like, because I be, I be on those PMS pills because, of, you know, of my um monthly and it, it, it i'm sorry y'all but i drag with those i'm sorry i'm so sorry uh like in my voice and everything i just be more relaxed if anything did they send you a check in the mail mm -hmm. they didn't send you from FedEx. Oh, you didn't? I said you missed it. Oh. Yeah, because I don't know about the income tax. They're telling me I got to send something. And they had sent an email to my phone in regard... I mean, saying that you needed to check your statement or whatever. Excuse me, y'all. Oh, okay. So, even in with this mess that's going on, a Pisces could have been involved with all of this as well. Betraying you. These people have been betraying you the whole time or whatever. Um... These people could have been putting out there that you talk too much, church members lied on you, all of it. Like this, what I'm getting is this is this group of narcissistic trying you, and it, you know nothing you can do to make a person that have been narcissistic all their life that feel that. They are entitled that they deserve all this good stuff, but what they're getting in in a total in in all totally is they're getting the devil's whatever the the devil have to offer them. When you're not operating from your higher self and you're not being legitimate and you're not being working out of a space of purity having pure intentions, not meaning anyone no harm and so forth or whatever. Um, when you're not operating as such, all of that is going to come back to you. Nevertheless, you have to pay the devil for anything that was good that he ever did for you. And you knew that you had ill will intentions and you were a bad person and you were trying to beat other people and you didn't want, to let anyone else through, you sabotaged others, you betrayed others to get to where you were trying to get to, you lied, you stole, you cheated, you, you know what I'm saying? You're never going to get away. And so these people have been doing this for years. And for some odd reason, they think when you come on the scene, oh, she can't tell me nothing. My life has been going like this. I got to where I'm at from doing this and now I'm about to do her too. Oh, they had they got the right one though cuz about you, I don't know, you know the measurements of spiritual growth or anything or who the other people belong to or if they were even coming from a space in a place of narcissism or the reason for why they just got their karma back done back to them through another person or what you don't know God's people's positions and you don't know who's chosen to come and deliver these messages and for people to think they're going to easily get away with it. No, 
It's not happening at all. It's getting ready to all come back. All come back on them. Every last single person that they ever misused, abused, belittled, stomped on, did ugly to get to a place and a space. It's about to hit them. And, and I'm telling you what's so critical and crucial about it is it's about to hit them. And Lord God have mercy. I don't care what they're doing behind the scene. Don't try to send nobody because someone's telling you, right? You know what you've been doing. That's been ugly all these years. No one have to tell you, you know what you did to manipulate situations, to deceive people, to lie, cheat, steal, to belittle people, to stomp on people, to prey on the weak, to, you know, you know what you did. No one have to come and, you know, do a thorough background check on your ugliness this is some things that you've been doing forever and you feel the need to think that oh i do what i want i get what i want and no one's gonna stop me oh yeah that's what you thought i don't care who you send for this person this chosen one y'all don't know it's angels it's deceased people it's you better hope that you know it doesn't hit your whole family and just wipe you clean. It's it's all up to the measurements of ugliness that you have been doing. It's going to either hit your finances, you physically, your family. It's getting ready to come for you. And it's almost like bad boys, bad boys. What you going to do? What you going to do when it come for you? Bad boys, bad boys. What you going to do? Because you thought you were big and bad. You thought that the higher power, power wasn't seeing you. You thought that you could do anything in this world and you would not be judged. It's a lot of people under judgment. And I all I'm telling you is to stop. And, and I mean, this is the final warning. I'm not going to even come back and try to press the issue to you. Anything like I'm getting sick of, you know, trying to make you understand you're facing something that's critical and the measurements of how you think that you're operating to sabotage and get at somebody else. It's about to come for you and it's about to come for you quick and you're not going to see it coming and it may hit you. It may hit your children. It may hit everything you own. It may hit you all in a total and wipe you clean. We don't know what the measurements of what it, it, it's about to be for what you have done, but you should have knew. You should have knew. Okay, I didn't get the finishes. Jealous of you. This is a person that behind the scene, they've been doing this. This is a person that is on the internet. They're st strategic about what they're doing. They're they know how to move and they feel as though they sitting up in this high position. They could have been doing that 20 years. Do you think Satan not ready for you to pay him for what he have given you? Oh no. It's a lot, a lot of people up for judgment and what God was trying to do through other people, little nits and gnats and things that were occurring and happening around you. He was giving you warning signs and you wouldn't take them. You wouldn't take them. This person, whoever it is, is jealous of you. These people, they may have even paid people to do ugly things toward you. This person is copying you. This person, you got the smoke for them. You, 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 you're not backing down. Uh, Aquarius is involved. This person is sort of kind of like a narcissist that, you know, they may copy the way you move your lips, to make the way you take your pictures, the way you, and, you know, they pretending as though they like you, but they don't. This person is a master manipulator. They use this tactic to get to where they are. This could be a very wealthy person, rich person. Uh, this They gain stock people. They've been doing it for years. They even use people. They put other people in front of the gun to do this sort of madness. They calling you broke. Oh, they were up on there calling you broke, but all in the same time 
taken from you, stealing from you, stealing your ideas, stealing your work, stealing whatever you're putting out, trying to stop you, trying to block you, using your information to gain them money. Thinking that, oh, no one will never know. Oh, and you bet not. You bet not try to retaliate is what they feeling. Oh, but you're not the one that's supposed to do the retaliation. It's not you. Spirit is to wipe them out and just to show as I'm sitting here saying it, I mean it. Taurus, a Taurus is involved. Calling you, but that's about to be them. Catfish stalker, really on the cool wanting to be you. This could be a whole man that's imitating a whole woman here. Do you get this? You are gay, bro. You're gay and you don't want to. That's part of the reason for why you sit here and stalk and watch and do the things you do. This person could have went into your information to try to find out something dirty on you. To use against you because you've been telling them the truth all the time and they just don't want to take it. And <clears throat> even behind the scene and use it for, you know, the grade of goodness and heal themselves, they choose to fight against you energetically and spiritually. You could be a Gemini. I'm getting strongly. You are a Gemini that these people are targeting. They're blocking your movement. They've been doing it the whole time. They've been getting work from you. Your ideas, your information, your knowledge, your wisdom. How can you be as sick as such? You already taken from this person and then have the nerves to catfish stalk them, then gain stalk them to gain insight, to gain ideas, to gain everything that you're doing. But all in the same token, you're really stealing, but you're calling this person broke. Wanting to use other people's information because you're jealous. But this person got the smoke for you. They don't care about you coming for them. You're, you're a betrayer. You betray people in the streets. You're going to continue to be a betrayer. You're a liar, a cheater, a thief. You keep up a lot of drama. You're not anyone's twin. You're not even divine. A Leo could be a part of it. You don't even know how to love. Your heart is closed off. Could have when you were younger or you were around people as such that sold drugs. Could have even went and tried to scrape up information. But all of this person's information that's being legitimate and real, their information is out on the table. So they don't have to lie, cheat, and steal from other people. They're telling you what it is. They, they're telling you who they are. So that's someone that's stalking you on the internet. Someone that's really, really jealous of you. This is a partner, whomever that you're dealing with. And the other person is have mental Ill, Ill, uh, issues as well. This is a Virgo. This person that this person is with, that this Virgo is with, they could be sensing that this person be fantasizing of your pictures or something or looking at you, want to get you pregnant. Kept you in third-party situations. Go get a checkup if you messed around with this person. Slept with someone you know. Uh, this person like young men. Whoever this person is that could be stalking, watching you, and getting insight on you is a pervert. You're a divine feminine. Your divine masculine is here. I don't know. This could be your divine masculine that need massive healing. And, you know, this is, you felt that, oh, this is lust. You know, this person wants sex with you. They deal with the sexual addictions. This person could be into young men. I'm sorry, but, you know, you just got some sick situations going on here. Or this is going on around you and this person. And people were causing have it or trying to put witchcraft on your divine masculine to make them fall into a perverted addiction, a sexual addiction with third party prostitutes, with younger, with young boys, 
and a Virgo is involved or this is the person that's doing this to someone that they are married to, they're in a relationship with, they these people are into threesomes. A uh, Virgo is involved with all of this. You know, it just varies. These people have slept with someone's friend. The reason for why they despise whomever the third party is. These people are into all of this mess. And you're just on the outside looking in. And someone love your sex. And again, a Gemini could be involved. But this person could be a community whore. They sleep with different people. They lie. They cheat. They steal. They is telling you to read the Bible. You know, get you some inspiration. The whole town hating because of some business idea that maybe you guys are involved with. With other people. Could be your family. Could be your kids. Could be I don't know, but the whole town is hating. You are a divine film. Whoever this is that is operating all around here, they're all around up and in, in throughout here in your energy. You're spiritual. They hate the fact. They hate the fact, but tell them get back. Gemini, you was on the bottom of the deck. You're over here now. This is severely in. Involved with the Gemini, Capricorn is involved with it. Love your sex, whoever this person is. Want to use you for sex. Whoever this person is, wants your talents that's around in your energy. Whole town hating on you. Tarot card reader, still in your work. He's jealous of your talents. Wow. Fair out jealous. Whoever these people are that are around in your energy, these people could be. Um, these people could be doctors, lawyers, actresses, celebrities, pastors, preachers, teachers. These the the people that. Are doing this besides the karmic masculines and people that want to see you fail. These people are wealthy people is what I'm getting that's doing this. They're stalking you, watching you, using your information to gain insight, to come up with something. Either they want to write a book, they want to make a movie, but your information for some odd reason mean the most to them because they want it. You must got some good stuff. They, she wants your talents. He's jealous of your talents. This person is jealous that you know a lot of things or whatever. The whole town hating on the internet, off the internet, tarot readers stealing. You're spiritual. They're fair out jealous. Want to use you for sex. A Libra is involved in all of this. And they're intimidated. These people go from person to person trying to take your looks. A Libra could be trying to take your looks. A fake tarot reader, divine masculine, want to tarnish your character. It's a child molester and a hater around you. They want your job. Sagittarius felt in reverse. Sagittarius could have been involved with this, but or this could be a past person that you dealt with was gossiping and spreading rumors and lies on you in the community, in your neighborhood. A Leo and a Virgo. All of these signs are involved. A Libra. The whole town hating. No coins. They even went and put witchcraft on your finances. Now they're scared that God is about to take or do something to their finances because they've been playing around with magic. Two-timer. Whoever this person is, they can always be getting cheated on. Their partner cheats on them and they wonder why. Because their energy is bad. Jealous of you. Wish well for them. Church hypocrites. Need healing from rape. Want your car to be broke. 
will rob you. Gain stalking you, not gang. Gain talking behind your back. You're a divine feminine. They put spell work, sent spell work, pay people. Even your baby dad is a part of this narcissistic triangulation. They're still in your work. Community whore. These people are community whores. They don't have no self-esteem. They have low self-esteem. They don't know who they are. They could be in the public side. They act as though, but do you know what they did to get there? No, you don't. These could be wealthy people. These could be people that act like they got it all together. Option to walk away when you, you see their true intentions. You know who they're, they are. Option to be fat and unhealthy. You could be, you know, starting to be big on your way or, you know, this is spirit's way or God's way of telling you. It's up to us if we want to be big, little, small, tall, whatever. Option to gain stop others option to keep up your hygiene this your option to keep up your hygiene option to not entertain third parties you're not into third parties you don't care nasty with your body in your home optional to be nasty with your body in your home option to hate others because of their talents what i'm getting strongly here is someone really hates you and there it's a karmic feminine option to be clean and somebody is just jealous they're narcissistic and they're making it their option to be narcissistic to clean your spirit inside and out optional due to jealousy optional due to take someone's life this is someone that's been taking someone's life they're jealous of your talents option to hate others because of their talents Someone is hating other people because of, and it's a karmic feminine. They may think that they're a divine one, but they're not. No matter of their money, no matter what position, because they're choosing not to heal themselves. And they've been, been like this for years, forever. And you come up in here and you trying to lead them to cleaning it up. And, oh, they don't want to. They don't want to. They just... Oh, I did what I did in the past, and I'm going to do you too. You can't tell me what to do. I do this. This is what I do. Terror reader, prejudice of Mex Mexicans. A terror reader worshiped the devil. Terror reader did spell work on other channels, and uh, they're uh, Aquarius. A terror reader did spell work on other channels. They're Libra backstabbing tarot card reader they're a backstabber tarot card reader prejudice of Japanese people a tarot card reader did spell work on others uh, channels of Aries a tarot card reader did someone in, in the tarot room have really been doing uh, magic and practicing uh, witchcraft on other people's channels and I'm going to tell you it's getting ready to backfire on them and hit them it, it, matter of fact, it could be doing it as now, and they don't even know what's going on. They're going and coming and running and coming back and don't even know what's... This is that I'm being attacked and da-da-da-da-da. No, you're being haunted from your own demons. You're prejudiced of other people. Tarot card reader did spell work on other channels. Gemini. Tarot card reader obsessed with you. This tarot card reader could be obsessed with you. You could be a Gemini. Tarot card reader, take your own advice. Tarot card reader, community whore. This is a person that sleep around, not him. Tarot card reader who was molested and also molested someone. A horny tarot card reader. So this is a person that cannot keep their sexual addictions under control and they're reading cards. Tarot card reader need healing from molestation. That's why they're all jacked up and need healing. Tarot card reader don't believe in God. It's a person that don't believe in God but probably could be throwing his name around everywhere. Tarot card reader need healing from partner abuse. Tarot card reader need healing right now. 
tarot card reader who need healing from family abuse. So this is a person that is narcissistic. They they haven't even begun to start their uh their healing process and they're reading cards. They try to say 